Hello, my name is Brandy, aka Pixelated Twix, and welcome back to another episode of Dragon Age Origins. The last time we left off, um, I forgot what we were doing exactly, but oh yes, we did our character creation and all that, and our lovely lady here, um, uh, a lovely lady, Alaria. You guys, I almost forgot her name. <laughs> Our lovely lady, Alaria, um, has been sent on a mission, or was sent on a mission by Sir Gilmore, and he um, basically told her that her dog, her Mabari hound, was in the kitchen um, acting up. So we are going to head off to the kitchen. Good evening, my lady. Good evening. And take care of that business, <clears throat> that bit of business. Yeah, that's her mother over there. I'm gonna avoid her for a little bit. Is it over here? No, this wasn't it. Okay, so we're gonna. I hear the dog barking. You guys, it's been a while since I played this game, so I like forget. Okay, I think it's down here. Is it here? Yeah. Okay. Get that bloody mutt out of the larder. But mistress, it won't let us near. If I can't get into that larder, I'll skin both of you useless elves. I swear it. Uh. Calm down, good woman. We've come to help. You and you. Your bloody mongrel keeps getting into my larder. That beast should be put down. All right, I'm sorry he's bothering you, Nan. He's not a mongrel. He's a pure-blood Mabari. Perhaps you should lock your larder tighter. Maybe you should be... Maybe you should be put down. Okay. Um, she's... She's diplomatic, so I'm going to go with... I'm sorry he's bothering you, Nan. Just get him gone. I've enough to worry about with a castle full of hungry soldiers. You two, stop standing there like idiots. Get out of the way. All right, yeah, there was no sense in making her any matter. Oh, to equip new items. Yeah, did I get something? No, I don't have anything. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, do you want me to do this? Remove your characters. Oh, fine. Really? For easy acts, I did this already. Fine. I'm taking this right off because I don't want it there. Okay. Um, pretty sure there was nothing in here. Can I talk to Nan still? Why are you talking to me, young lady? That wretched creature is likely eating my beautiful roast as we speak. Um, let's ask her some questions. How did he get into the larder this time? I can't help it if my hound is too smart for his own good. Intimidate. You will keep a civil tongue or I will cut it out. Please calm down, Nan. Um, let's just ask how he got in the larder in the first place. How in the blazes am I supposed to know? He up and walked through the wall, I expect. That hound isn't natural. I see it in his eyes. He does this on purpose just to torment me. She just doesn't like dogs. Let's just let's just be real. She doesn't like dogs. She's oh uh no she, we're not gonna be an ages. Better than later. She's just grumpy. I was gonna say she was old and bitter, but <laughs> oh, look at that mess. How did he even get in here? I just realized Mavari Hans are rat a uh, rats. <laughs> Rat Rylers. <laughs> okay. Uh, sorry. Um, enough. You're a bad boy. Do you hear me? What a smart boy you are. Oh, yes, you are. Oh, yes, you are. <laughs> Sit right there. I'm not putting up with this. Are you trying to tell me something, boy? Let's... My barry hounds are really, really smart. So anything they do, it's for a reason. So she knows this. I'm going to go with, are you trying to tell me something, boy? He does like, seem like he's trying to tell you something. Wait, did you hear that? Okay, so I gotta name my dog. Let's see. I'm gonna name my dog. Um, what am I gonna name my dog? Let's name him Maverick. <laughs> no. All right. Let's Mavericks. No. Let's name him Augie. Oh, let's name him Augie. What is that? The door in the way? Yeah, that's the door. Okay. Let's 
So we named him Augie. Oh! <clears throat> These are New York style. New York style. Wow, use your bells today. These are New York size rats. Giant rats? It's like the start of every bad adventure tale my grandfather used to tell. Your hound must have chased them in through their holes. Looks like he wasn't raiding the larder after all. It certainly looks that way. Those were very large. Those were extremely large rats. So we're going to go with two. Yeah. I've seen larger. They come up from the Kakari wilds sometimes. But seeing as you've got your Mabari well in hand, I'll be on my way. I'm to prepare for the arrival of more of the Isle's men. All right. Do we have anything to loot? Of course we do. Elf fruit. This wooden crate over here. Quartz. That's it. Nothing else. No more goodies. Can we talk to our pup? Yep. He's all bloody. So am I. Uh, can we do something about... No, that's disgusting. Um, do you see anything interesting? Oh, he didn't find anything. Okay, I love that he actually searches for things and can bring goodies back. So let's go there talk to him. There he is, as brazen as you please, licking his chops after helping himself to the roast, no doubt. I mean, did she not see that? She was standing right there. Um, actually, Nan, he was defending your larder from big rats. What? Rats? Mm -hmm. Not the large gray ones. They'll rip you to shreds, they will. See, now you've gone and scared the servants. I expect those filthy things are dead. Um, my faithful warhound made sure it's safe. Oh, I bet that dog led those rats into there to begin with. She's a hater. She's a hater. Oh, don't even start with the sad eyes. I'm immune to your so-called charms. Here then. Take these pork bits and don't say that Nan never gives you anything. Bloody dog. Thank you, my lady. Now we can get to work. That's right, you two. Quit standing about. And so, folks, Nan really does have a heart. Okay. Can we talk to the servants? We will serve you well while the tarim is gone. Oh. Okay, so let's go into the store because I don't think we've been here yet. Is there any, ooh, there's a kitty cat. I, I don't think I've ever been in this room. <laughs> I'm laughing because I've played this game so many times and I'm pretty sure I've never been in here. <laughs> oh my gosh. I, I, I find that to be funny, sorry. Okay, so we're gonna head up to talk to our maza. Good evening, my lady. Good evening. Ah, uh, there she is. She's got company. And my dear Bryce bought this back from Orlais last year. The Marquis who gave it to him was drunk, I understand, and mistook Bryce for the king. Ah, here is my lovely daughter. I take it by the presence of that troublesome hound of yours that the situation in the kitchen is handled? Um, yes, Mother. Nana's back to work as we speak. Yes, there were giant rats in the larder. I don't know if I want to say that in front of guests. Um... Ned's head exploded and my hound ate the kitchen staff. I mean, she could be snarky too, but I could I guess we could go with that. Let's just go with the snarky remark and see where it goes. Well, at least one of us will have had a decent dinner. Perhaps your hound left something I can feed my guests. Darling, you remember Lady Landra, Van Lawrence's wife? I think we last met at your mother's spring salon. Mom has a sense of humor. I'm like, Mom, I've never chose that um, response, and I love it. Okay, of course, it's good to see you again, my lady. Uh, weren't you drunk? Okay, we don't have <laughs> to go there. Um, let's say this will have to wait. Father has sent me to find... No, let's, let's not be rude. Of course, it's good to see you again, my lady. You're too kind, dear girl. Didn't I spend half the salon trying to convince you to marry my son? And made a very poor case for it, I might add. You remember my son, Dyron. He's not married yet, either. Don't listen to her. It's good to see you again, milady. You're looking as beautiful as ever. Why, thank you. 
flatterer. Go soak your head. You're looking handsome yourself. I mean, he looks like a potato, but I'm going to say thank you. You know, take a compliment. And this is my lady in waiting, Iona. Do you say something, dear? It is a great pleasure, my lady. You are as pretty as your mother describes. You would think that it would make it easier to make a match for her, not more difficult. Perhaps your daughter simply has a mind of her own, your ladyship. You should be proud. Proud doesn't get me any more grandchildren. Ah, she sounds like my real mother. Okay, I can handle my own affairs, thank you. May I go now, mother? I think she's going to try to excuse herself from the entire conversation. Um, let's see, you're aware we're at war. Uh, perhaps we should speak alone sometime, Tyrion. Mm, okay, that response is loaded. So I'm not really interested. And the way I'm going to play her, this would not be this would not be her response. So um, I'm going to have her excuse herself. Of course, darling. You must have many things to do before Fergus and your father leave. I think perhaps I shall rest now, my dear. Dairon, I will see you and Iona at supper. Perhaps we'll retire to the study for now. Yes, you should. Good evening, your ladyship. Good evening. All right, you know, let's talk to Mom for a little bit. You should say goodbye to Fergus while you have the chance. Oh, Mom, you're too close, too close. You're right, I should go. Did you, did you know there are wardens here? Yeah, let's ask her about that. Yes, your father mentioned that. You haven't got it into your head that you want to be recruited. Mm, she knows me far too well. Um, father wouldn't allow it. The Darkspawn have returned. Grey Wardens are needed. Would that be so bad? Definitely not. Um, she knows that her father wouldn't allow it, but she's pretty, um, strong-willed, so I don't think that this would matter to her. Um, wouldn't that, would that be so bad? There's enough here at the castle to occupy you. I don't need you off chasing danger like your brother. I should go. Do you know where Fergus might be? Why can't I go with Father and Fergus? I have a bad feeling. Um, would she though? I mean, I guess with everybody showing up at the castle all of a sudden and then them leaving, the Grey Warden showing up at the castle all of a sudden and then her father and brother leaving. Um, let's see. Uh, wait a minute. Are you staying at the castle? For a few days. Then I'll travel with Lady Landra to her estate and keep her company for a time. Your father thinks my presence here might undermine your authority. Okay, so I don't think you should go. I I was about to suggest that myself. Um no, I don't think she wants her mother to go. I mean, as as strong willed as she is and headstrong as she is, I don't think she exactly wants to be alone at this time because you know, everything that's going on right now, I'm pretty sure she doesn't really want to be alone in the castle. Don't worry, my dear. It won't be long. <clears throat> All right, well, uh, why can't I go with Father and Fergus? I know it's difficult to stay in the castle and watch others ride off, but we must see to our duties first. You understand that, don't you? Um, what if they fall without me? I could make a difference. I could make a difference. You are here. Trust me, you'll get your chance for excitement soon enough. Okay, well, do you know where... If, I think we already asked Father about that, so I should go. I love you, my darling girl. You know that, don't you? I love you, too. Go do what you must, then. I will see you soon. Ah, foreboding. Okay, let's see. <clears throat> Excuse me. I think there's a couple more places I can check out before I... What is this? Yeah. I don't think there's anything in here. Nope. Okay, so I, we're... Good up, evening, my lady. Good evening. I can go upstairs. Um, this door, I think I can't get in. Yeah. And this door either. Okay, so we're going to go in here. All right, all right. What's in here? Okay, that's my bedroom. This is... Okay, yeah, this is where is my brother really is. Is there really going to be a war, Papa? Will you bring me back a sword? 
That sword, Oren. So I'll cute. get you the mightiest one I can find, I promise. I'll be back before you know it. I wish victory was indeed so certain. My heart is disquiet. Don't frighten the boy, love. I speak the truth. And here's my little sister to see me off. Now dry your eyes, love, and wish me well. Should I wait outside? <laughs> no. <laughs> okay, okay, I'm sorry. Should I wait outside? Uh, just let me know when you two are finished. Uh, yeah, just let me know when you two are finished. <laughs> when there's a man in your life, you'll understand. Who says I need a man? Mm-hmm. Um, I prefer my freedom. Thank you. I'm saying, uh, who said I don't have one now, right? And men are overrated. Okay, I can't say I agree with that all the time. No fewer than three, if you please. Okay. Um, who says I don't have one now? I mean, such a thing would bring shame upon this house, sister. Oh, but if it's true, you must be discreet. I'm not sure how I should take that, love. As the advice of a practical and even woman, my dear. Oh, goodness. Did she just shade me? Um, anyways, I bring a message. Father wants you to leave without him. I wish I could go with you. You'll be missed, brother. Do you... Did you know there was a great warden in the castle? Yeah, let me ask him that. Really? Was he riding a griffin? Oh, so Warren. cute. Griffins only exist in stories now. I'd heard that. Did he say why he's come? Huh. Uh, he says he's recruiting. He's going to test Sir Gilmore. I, I don't recall him actually saying that specifically, but I do know he's recruiting. So we'll go with that. Oh, if I were a Grey Warden, little sister, I'd have my eye on you. Not that father would ever allow it. Oh. Well, uh, either way, I bring you a message. Father wants you to leave without him. Then the Isle's men are delayed. You'd think his men were all walking backwards. Well, I'd better get underway. So many darks born to be ahead, so little time. Off we go then. I'll see you soon, my love. I would hope, dear boy, that you plan to wait for us before taking your leave. Be well, my son. I will pray for your safety every day you are gone. All right, so a good shield would be more useful. You could have delivered your message yourself, Father. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you had me come all the way up here. And, okay, um, a good shield would be more useful. Fergus will be fine. He might need those prayers. Um, I think he'll be fine. But a, definitely a good shield would be Make more useful. Sustain and preserve us all. Watch over our sons, husbands, and fathers, and bring them safely back to us. And bring us some ale and wenches while you're at it. Uh, for the men, of course. Fergus, you would say this in front of your mother? What's a wench? <laughs> Is that what you pull on to get the bucket out of the well? <laughs> a wench is a woman that pours the ale in a tavern, Oren. Or a woman who drinks a lot of ale. Bryce, make us breath. It's like living with a pair of small boys. Thankfully, I have a daughter. I'll miss you, mother dear. You'll take care of her, sister, won't you? Oh, just go already. You can count on me. You need protecting more than her. Mother can handle herself, always has. Yeah, her mother's um, pretty spirited, and um, I know for sure she can handle it's herself. It's true. They should be sending her, not me. She would scold those darkspawn back into the deep roads. Well, I'm glad you find this so funny. <laughs> enough, <laughs> enough. Pup, you'll want to get an early night. You've much to do tomorrow. Yes, I have much to do. Um, anything I can loot? Ah, uh, every time you gain a level, your character gains new abilities and improves statistics. Left click on the plus button next to your character's portrait level to level up. Oh, okay. <clears throat> All right, so we definitely need to add some strength. Um, and I want some more cunning, dexterity. Do I don't need magic. Let me just make sure I don't need willpower. Okay, so willpower helps me with my stam. I, okay, so we're just going to add some stam. But I, yeah, I'm probably going to need stam. All right. Actually, let's, let's go with more strength because um, I think I'm going to need that. All right. 
So my skills, we've got coercion. Um, I'm not going to focus on that. Trap making, not really. Survival might be something I could work on because um, I think I, I do need that later for a quest. Um, combat tactics or improved combat training. I, I, uh, I don't need herbalism. Um, let's go with improved combat training. And then I think I can, okay, that's level four. I think I can grab, um, what do I want? Dual finesse or let's go with dual strike. Yeah, let's do that. All right. Okay. Cutscene. What's wrong, boys? There is someone out there. I, obviously, there's someone out there. I've had just about enough of you today. Are you hearing rats again? Go after them already. All right, let's go with one. I think that's appropriate. What's wrong, boy? My lady, help me! The castle is under attack! <laughs> oh, rip ears. Good lord. Wait, let me... um turn this down because that scared <laughs> the mess out of me um i don't want to let's bring the music down just a tad maybe the sound effects just a tad okay here we go all right oh i don't have anything wait where am i Cannot equip this item on this character. Do I not have anything on? Okay, so I guess because I'm in combat, I'm going to have to punch the dude to death. First of all, what am I doing? Wow. Amateur. Now you're fighting in my panties and bra. How appropriate. Okay, first of all, let me go in here. Can I get you a ladder so you grab can get off my back? This and I do okay. Loot him. Where is the tear? Tell us. Alright, alright. I'll get on it. I'm gonna have to map these to my my mouse button. Check I'll my... teach you. Oh. Darling, I heard fighting outside and I feared the worst. Are you hurt? I'm fine. What's going on? I was about to ask you that. I was about to ask you that. Uh, I'm fine. What's going on? The scream woke me up. There were men in the hall, so I barred the door. Did you see their shields? Those are Howe's men. Why would they attack us? He's betrayed father. He attacks, with the... he attacks while our troops are gone. I don't know, mother, but we need to get out of here. I don't know how she would know this. Well, I mean, I guess it's stating the obvious. Um, but he's betrayed father. He attacked, let's say that. Um, yeah. You don't think Hal's men were delayed? On purpose? That bastard. I'll cut his lying throat myself. Have you seen your father? He never came to bed. No, I haven't. I was in my room. Maybe he stayed up with Earl Hal. Uh, he could already be. No, let's not say that. I was in my room. We must find him. Uh, maybe you should stay here. 
Can you still handle a weapon, mother? Okay, she knows that her mom can fight, so... Uh, but we should check on Oriana and Oren as well. And dressed his mercy. What if the soldiers went into your brother's room first? Let's check on them quickly. Then we'll look for Bryce downstairs. I mean, but before we check on them... You can get off my back. Let's... I need to, uh, loot some things. <gasps> I mean, I'm not surprised, no. but... My little Oren. What manner of fiend slaughters innocence? This is heartbreaking. Like, how could you take the life of a child? Like, first of all, just helpless people and then a child that... Oh, man. <clears throat> Why would they do this? Or I will make them pay. No, I will make them pay. I was not even taking hostages. <clears throat> he me. means to kill all of us. Oh, poor fuckers. Let's go. I don't want to see this. I don't care how many times I Something play this coming. game. That is so hard to see. Now's better than later. Oh, did, oh the dog leveled up. I was like... I'll get on it. I do not fear death. I have nothing else to lose. I might have to bump up the difficulty. Uh, but let's level up Augie. And all right. So he is our tank right now. So I'm going to give him all the strength and constitution. Um, and I was that it? I guess it was. Let's go back and. Got it. I didn't loot back here. Okay, so... Uh, ugh. Wait, what's in here? Oh, it's another... No, oh, okay, that was my room. Duh. Whose room was this? Perhaps we can salvage some things. Here, darling. Some of your father's belongings are in that trunk. Okay, let me see what mom has for equipment. Okay, so here's our equipment screen. And um, Eleanor, she has, what is she working with? Okay, she's got, she don't have a thing. Okay, so I need to give her a bow. Um, short. Let's give her a bow because that's what she's good at. Um... She's just been beating people down with her bare hands. She's a G. Um, also, as a backup, I want to give her two maces. Can I do that? Oh, wait. Is this one-handed? No, this is... Oh, this is a main hand. Okay. Give her a dagger. Actually, is that better than what I have? It is. Okay. Um... All right, so yeah, let us push on. All right, um, we already went in here. We did not loot this chest. All right, all right. All right, and pretty sure we didn't go. Yeah. Oh dear, Landra. I'm I'm so sorry. I was the guest. How do you if kill? If she hadn't come to me, if she hadn't been here, that's got to be rough. I mean, just the fact that you lost your 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 daughter-in-law, your grandchild, and your friend, and possibly your husband, all in the same night, you know, um, and betrayed by a friend. Housemen must be everywhere. What should we do? Um, I think. She's pretty level-headed, uh, so she, I don't know. She might ask her mom because her mom's obviously an experienced fighter. Um, we should take the fight to them. How do we get out of the castle? I think that'll be their main goal is to get out. Um, but no, she also doesn't want her mother in danger. So, I mean, how do we get out of the castle? That's the best way to get out of danger. The servants' passage leads out from the larder, but we must find your father first. The front gate. 
That's where you'll follow must be. All right, so, okay. Um, let's go. There's nothing else we can do. We just can't let Hal win. What if father isn't there? She wants to get out of the castle, but she also doesn't want Hal to win. She doesn't want him to succeed in his, this treachery. So, um, but she wants to know if there's something other that they can do other than run. Um, no, I think at this point, all their soldiers are gone. There's not much else they can do. Probably getting to Arl Howe would be dang near impossible. Um, so, is there nothing else I we have can my do? Key. We could go there first and take the Kuslan sword from the vault. If anything is worth fighting to keep out of Howe's hands, it's that sword. But it may be a dangerous path. Well, then let's go. Let's go to the treasury. Howe's men are inside. They must already control the castle. We must use the servants entering the larder to escape. Do you hear me? I want how dead. Um. Yeah, she does. But I think our bi biggest concern is finding her father and getting her mother, um, getting them out of the castle. Okay, so you don't have to tell me twice. Then let us be swift. All right, so let's go in here really quick. Now's better than later. That's another dagger. I don't even know what my inventory is looking like, but the castle has fallen. I'm getting out of here. Really? Persuade. Don't be a coward. Stand and fight. Yes. Yes, my lady. Here, here they come. All right. Wait. Oh. I can't give him something? Oh my gosh, he is... Now's better than later. Got it. Get him. I'll get on it. It's probably not a good idea. Got it. We're under attack. Now's better than later. Oh my gosh. There's too many of them. <laughs> wow. I can't have the other dude die. Okay. Ooh, okay, let's um take a breather for a moment. Oh, okay. No! Turn it. Okay, the Murray the Navari hounds are ridiculous. Oh, mom! Wait a minute. She's got to take a potion. Okay, can't have her dead. What is your command? We will not be Seriously? Oh no, we lost the dude. Oops. <laughs> Okay, that uh... you gave me no choice. Okay, this is the treasury. We're gonna go back and loot. I think there's some people in there. Or are we? Oh, everybody's dead in there. Okay, we're gonna loot first. Yes, definitely get some of these health poultices because we need them. Is there anybody in here? Nope, everybody's dead. That was, um, really? That's it? Okay, so, oh wait, where was it? No, it was down here. 
Okay, let's go in here really quick. Yeah, everybody's dead in here. He will be avenged, old sage. I swear it. I wonder what happened to the kids. All right, so another blank vellum. I mean, at least we got a poultice. I think we got. Okay, that was it. There's. Yeah, we're a little low. Oh, good. Awesome. All right. Um. Maybe I should have picked up herbalism. Uh. All right. So let's loot his body, and then I think. We can go down here. We're getting close to the treasury. The Kuzlan family blade lies inside. Use that key I gave you. That blade cannot fall into Hal's hands. We are bloody messes. Okay, so the guards are dead. Um, that's not good. Okay, let's get to looting. There's a shield. There's a Kuzlan shield. Another bow um, and a family chest. So we have a sword and a shield. Actually, let me check the sword out and see if this is better. I'm pretty sure it's probably better than what we have. Yeah. All right. So we'll take that. And... Oh! Die already! Can I get you a ladder so you can get off my back? Okay. All right. Don't run. Fight like a man. All right. I'm gonna loot your buddies though if, before I leave. All right. Good. Okay. And. Okay, so one of these rooms, all the potions, I need them all. Oh, awesome. Lots of bodies to loot. Um, I think that was it. Everybody's dead. I'll get on it. Oh, yeah. Oh, this is a mess. This lady has to die. Okay. Oh, 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 I died. I died. <laughs> oh, shoot. Kill the mage. Kill the mage. Oh. Y'all, we might be dead. <laughs> we got the dog left. Oh God! Get the mage! I don't have anything for the dog. Kill the mage! Oh gosh! Aki, you gotta save the day. Where do these creatures come from? Oh! Man, the gate. Keep those bastards out as long as you can. Your ladyship, my lady, you're both alive. I was certain Hal's men had gotten through. That was rough. They did get through. How is the treacherous bastard? Have you seen my father? Okay, first. First things first. Have you seen my father? Or, well, yes. He was looking for you two. He told us to hold the hall as long as possible. When I realized what was happening, it was all I could do to shut the gates. But they won't keep Hal's men out long. If you've another way out of the castle, use it quickly. Uh, we need to find Father. We need to find Father. Where's the Grey Warden? Yeah, where's the Grey Warden? I've no idea. You don't think he's involved in this, do you? Perhaps he was sent to kill Bryce? Oh dear. Have you seen him? When I last saw the turn, he'd been badly wounded. I urged him not to go, but he was determined to find you. He went towards the kitchen. I believe he thought to find you at the servant's exit in the larder. Bless you, Sakomo. Make her watch over you. Make her watch over us all. Yeah. All right. Uh, before we go find father. 
Loot these bodies. Where's that mage? I'll get on it. Um. Okay. Oh, almost missed a couple bodies. Whoops. And now's okay. better than later. Okay. Did I get everything? Yeah. All right. <clears throat> We're under attack. I hate that I lost that other guy because he would have been an excellent. Excuse me. I feel like the sound might be up a little too loud. Guys, let me know in the comments if the sound is too loud, if you can't hear me over the, the game, uh, and I can adjust the levels. All right. <clears throat> Run! 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 I will kill them all Stop myself. It. Can I get you a ladder? You can get it back. Now's better than later. Now's better than later. I need him to hang out. So I have to save his life. All right, nothing to loot in here. A couple bodies to loot, maybe. Yes. We need all the potions. You guys, coming with? Is this a dead end? This is. Okay, let me see. We went this way already. Um. Is it up here? Yeah. Okay. Come on. <laughs> Get you a ladder. You can get off my back. Oh, shoot. I'll get on it. This is for my own run. Let's see that blood. You can get off my back. Oh, shoot. He's a, a legendary or a rare. What is horror? And I rip you up. I do not fear death. I have nothing else to lose. We must stop them. Not it. Let's see what you make of going, my He better have some good loot on him. He had some money. That's it. Okay. So let's head down this way. Um, I think this might be the kitchen. Okay, that's the kitchen. I just want to go in here really quick. Um, oh no, this is the kitchen. What's in here? Or is this the kitchen? No. Okay, I think that's it. Look, I'm so worried about looting. I'm, I know my father is in the next room. All right. Uh, let's head in. That is an awful lot of blood. There, you both are. I was. Bryce. Wondering when you would get here. Maker's blood, what's happening? You're bleeding. Owl's men. Honey, he's in a pool of blood. Found me first. Almost did me in right there. Okay, why is Hal doing this? We need to get out of here. How did you get here? You can hardly move. Okay. She's not going to be concerned about Hal right now. She's just her father's laying in a pool of blood. So we need to get you out of here. I... I won't survive the standing, I think. That's not true. You'll be fine. All right, then we'll stay and defend you. Uh, we'll simply have to drag... You. She will drag him out if she has to. So then we'll simply drag you out. Only if you're willing to leave pieces of me behind. <sighs> Bryce, this is no time for jokes. Once Hal's men break through the gate, they will find us. We must go. Someone must reach Fergus. Tell him what has happened. And take vengeance. That he's the new Tyran? Hal must have something planned for him, too. You can tell him yourself, Father. Um. 
Yeah, you can tell him yourself. I wish I could go. Oh. Bryce, no. The servant's passage is right here. We can flee together, find you healing magic. The castle is surrounded. I cannot make it. I'm afraid the turn is correct. Pao's men have not yet discovered this exit, but they surround the castle. Getting past will be difficult. You are Duncan, then? The Grey Warden? Yes, your ladyship. The turn and I tried to reach you sooner. My daughter helped me get here. Make her be praised. I am not surprised. Are you going to help us, Duncan? Um, I'm surprised you haven't already left. Thank you for saving my father. Um, are you going to help us? Whatever is to be done now, it must be quick. They are coming. Duncan, I beg you. Take my wife and daughter to safety. I will, your lordship. But I fear I must ask for something in return. Anything. What is happening here pales in comparison to the evil now loose in this world. I came to your castle seeking a recruit. The Darkspawn threat demands that I leave with one. I... I understand. All right. Are you talking about me? What about Sir Gilmore? Wait, what? No, I won't agree to any such thing. Um, but what if something has happened to Fergus? Um, she's going to be more worried about her family. Um, what, if, what if something happened to Fergus? The king will see justice done. The Grey Wardens, however, must face the darkspawn above all else. He is right, pup. I will take the Tirna and your daughter to Ostagar to tell Fergus and the King what happened. Then your daughter joins the Grey Wardens. So long as justice comes to how. I agree. Then I offer you a place within the Grey Wardens. Fight with us. I accept your offer. I refuse. I won't go. My duty is to take vengeance on Earl Howe. But what if Fergus is dead? Um... But what if Fergus is dead? We will inform the king, and he will punish Howe. I'm sorry, but a Grey Warden's duties take precedence even over vengeance. Howe thinks he'll use the chaos to advance himself. Make him wrong, pup. See that justice is done. Our family always does our duty first. The Darkspawn must be defeated. You must go, for your own sake and for Ferelden's. I will, Father, for you. We must leave quickly, then. Bryce, are you sure? Our daughter will not die of Hal's treachery. She will live and make her mark on the world. Darling, go with Duncan. You have a better chance to escape without me. Eleanor. Hush, Bryce. I'll kill every bastard that comes through that door to buy them time. But I won't abandon you. I won't let you sacrifice yourself. We can find another way. We can fight. I love you both so much. Um, she knows her mother isn't going to leave her father. And she doesn't want the last, her last words to be, I won't let you sacrifice yourself. Um, I think she would want them to know that she loves them. And, you know, because this is the last time she'll see them alive. So... I love you both so much. Then live, darling. Become a Grey Warden and do what is right. I'm just so sorry it's come to this, my love. We had a good life and did all we could. It's up to our children now. Then go, pup. Warn your brother. And know that we love you both. You do us proud. They've broken through the gates. We must go now. Goodbye, darling. I know this was serious, but did you guys see that pool of blood just reappear? <laughs> Disappear and reappear? Just me? All right. We will be traveling south through the hinterlands to the ruin of Ostagar on the edges of the Korkari Wilds. The Tevinter Imperium built Ostagar long ago to prevent the Wilders from invading the northern lowlands. It's fitting we make our stand here, even if we face a different foe within that forest. 
The King's forces have clashed with the Darkspawn several times, but here is where the bulk of the Horde will show itself. There are only a few Grey Wardens within Ferelden at the moment, but all of us are here. This blight must be stopped, here and now. If it spreads to the north, Ferelden will fall. Ho there, Duncan. King Caelan. I didn't expect a... A royal welcome? I was beginning to worry you'd miss all the fun. Not if I could help it, your majesty. Then I'll have the mighty Duncan at my side in battle after all. Glorious. The other wardens told me you'd found a promising recruit. I take it this is she? Allow me to introduce you, your majesty. No need, Duncan. You are Bryce's youngest, are you not? I don't think we've ever actually met. Are you not even aware my father is dead? Yes, your majesty. My name is Alaria. Yes, I am. And... I bring important news. I will be respectful because, you know, he is the king. Your brother has already arrived with High Ever's men, but we are still awaiting your father. Um, he is not coming. He died when our castle was taken. Dead? What do you mean? Duncan, do you know anything about this? Terran Kuzland and his wife are dead, your majesty. Arl Howe has shown himself a traitor and overtaken High Ever Castle. Had we not escaped, he would have killed us and told you any story he wished. I can scarcely believe it. Well, how could he think he could get away with such treachery? As soon as we are done here, I will turn my army north and bring Hal to justice. You have my word. Thank you, Your Majesty. No doubt you wish to see your brother. Unfortunately, he and his men are scouting in the wilds. But he may be in danger. Uh, when will he return? I am not eager to tell him, Your Majesty. I think she'd rather not tell him right away because he needs his mind on the battle ahead. So uh, he needs no distractions. Of that, I have no doubt. You will see him again once the battle is over, I am certain. I apologize, but there's nothing more I can do. Yeah. All I can suggest is that you vent your grief against the Darkspawn for the time being. Okay, thank you, Your Majesty. Uh, so, so long as Earl Hal pays, I'm happy. Uh, what would you, what would you know about my grief? I think that's rude, um, but I can understand why she would say that. Um, thanks for nothing, then. Um, I, I think she. I don't know how I would feel about this because she's in a lot of grief right now and she hasn't had any time to come to terms with that. I mean, she left her family, her parents to die and now she's being brought into the midst of the Great Wardens to fight another front, um, a, a fight, you know, another battle. Um, and she can't talk to her brother. She knows she can't. And so she's, you know, grieving inside. Um, so I don't know. I think she's strong enough that she would try. She understands that, you know, she has to push on for now. And that um, Earl Howe will pay eventually. Um and that the king is doing the best he can. She realizes that the Darkspawn are coming. So that's important because, you know, the Darkspawn are uh, pure evil. Um, and they will stop at nothing to destroy mankind. So I think she realizes that once this is done, they will do what's necessary to stop Earl Hal. So, yeah, I'll go with. So as long as Earl Hal pays, I'm happy. I'm sorry to cut this short, but I should return to my tent. Loghain waits eagerly to bore me with his strategies. Your uncle sends his greetings and reminds you that Redcliffe forces could be here in less than a week. Ha! <laughs> Eamon just wants in on the glory. We've won three battles against these monsters, and tomorrow should be no different. Um, I didn't realize things were going so well. It sounds like the blight is almost over. You sound very confident of that. Oh, you sound very confident of that. Overconfident, some would say. Right, Duncan? <laughs> Your Majesty, I'm not certain the blight can be ended quite as...
quickly as you might wish. I'm not even sure this is a true blight. There are plenty of darkspawn on the field, but alas, we've seen no sign of an archdemon. Disappointed, Your Majesty? I'd hoped for a war like in the tales. A king riding with the fabled Grey Wardens against a tainted god. But I suppose this will have to do. I must go before Loghain sends out a search party. Farewell, Grey Wardens. Did she do Wakanda forever? Okay. What the king said is true. They've won several battles against the Darkspawn here. Yet, you don't seem sound very reassured. He didn't seem to take the dark spawn very seriously. Perhaps this isn't a blight after all. No, he didn't seem to take the dark spawn very seriously. I mean, he was almost gleeful. True. Despite the victory so far, the dark spawn horde grows larger with each passing day. By now, they look to outnumber us. I know there is an arch demon behind this. But I cannot ask the king to act solely on my feeling. Um, then maybe we should move quickly. What would you have him do? Why not? He seems to regard the Grey Wardens highly. Um, you could, if he were not such a fool. Do you think there's any danger? Um, then maybe we should move quickly? Yes, we should proceed with the ritual. What do you need me to do? What do you mean? What r ritual? Yeah, a hot meal might... She might not be hungry. I'm pretty sure she's probably not hungry right now. It's the last thing on her mind. But what do you mean this ritual? Every recruit must go through a secret ritual we call the joining in order to become a Grey Warden. The ritual is brief, but some preparation is required. We must begin soon. Okay. Um... What do you need me to do? Feel free to explore the camp here as you wish. All I ask is that you do not leave it for the time being. There is another Grey Warden in the camp by the name of Alistair. When you're ready, seek him out and tell him it's time to summon the other recruits. Your hound can stay with me while I attend to some business. The Grey Warden tent is on the other side of this bridge. You will find us there should you need to. All right. Um, I think I'm going to leave it there. Just to recap, you know, um, Alary has, uh, she's on her own now. She's lost her family. I, her brother is out somewhere in the woods. Um, I'm not sure what he's doing out there, but um, obviously their paths are not going to cross at this point. So, um, she's got a long road ahead and, um, I think she realizes that, but just knowing the fact that, um, you know, that she's going to be alone in this is going to be hard for her to come to terms with, come to terms with, but anyways, all right. So the next episode will continue with Alaria and I guess we'll explore the campsite um, and meet up with this other gray warden and I will talk to you later until next time. Ciao.